I'm going to show how a line works in Microsoft Publisher by setting up a three column page with centered images. I'll add guidelines to create the three columns. A line works differently depending on if relative to margin guidelines is selected. When it's selected, it aligns the graphic to the page margin. So if I highlight the X's and choose a line left, it's going to place them against the margin. If I turn off relative to page margin, then the images will align to the furthest left image. If I only have one item selected, then the align options are disabled because there's nothing to align when the relative to margin is off. Now for the distribute options. With relative to margin turned on, distribute horizontally places an equal distance between the page margin and each object. With relative to margin off, distribute horizontally will center what's in the middle, leaving the end images in place. You can also use objects as containers to align items with relative to margin turned off. If I had a rectangular shape, I can align the graphic within it by selecting both and aligning where I want it. Those are the basic rules of aligning. Now I'll create a three column page with the center images. I use this rectangle as the container and align it to the first column. And just repeat that for the other two columns. Then center the image. That's it.